Para la reunión personalizada, para la entrevista personal, tienen que meterse a este link que les acabo de mandar, ¿ok? Que se los habían enviado con anticipación. Métase a ese link, por favor. Hola, Madeline, ¿qué pasó? No se ha metido al link. Hola, Madeline. No se ha metido al link. Tiene que meterse al link, al que acabo de mandar al grupo. ¿Cómo no? Está en el grupo de, de, de nosotros, donde yo mando toda la información. Y, pero ya Elena, no, es que, es que no, no, la, la, la entrevista personal no va en la, en la, en la misma reunión que acabamos de terminar, sino que. No, vaya, eh, vaya, eh, te voy a mandar la, quiero ver. Ahorita te voy a mandar cuál es la, la información del meeting, ¿verdad? Ajá. Esa, es que esa es. Dale. Si aquí estoy yo esperando, estoy en esta reunión. Dale, vuelve, vuelve a entrar. Ahora, este, vas a entrar a las 10.40, ¿oíste? Porque ya son las 10 y 10. 10 y 10. Vaya, ok. Vaya. Ok, fine. Hello, guys. How are you today?
Blanca, Blanca, ya puede entrar Blanca a este link que está en el grupo, al que les acabo de mandar. Entre. So, hello, guys, how are you? Okay, today we're going to talk about transition words. Okay. So transition words are those that you use to link to ideas, to sentences, or to paragraphs, okay? And there are some punctuation rules that you need to address, okay? And Para la entrevista personal tiene que meterse a este link que le acabo de mandar, ok, que se lo habían enviado con anticipación. Métase a ese link, por favor. Hola. Sí, Frank, en el caso de Alcira, yo no se la puedo mandar, o sea, como no tengo el número de contacto, no se la he mandado directo. Por eso es que se lo, lo puse ahí en el enlace y le dije a Orlando que se lo mandara a él. En el caso de Víctor, sí ya se lo mandé yo directo porque tengo el número de él. Ahí, este, bueno, voy a, voy a pedirle a Orlando de que él me mande directamente lo, lo, los enlaces porque no me ha mandado los números de contacto. Ese es el, el, en esta vez, pues va, ¿ok? Hi, teacher. Hello. Hello. Family. Hello. Oh, uh, sorry, but but I I am waiting for the session, but I don't I don't know what happened. But did Elena did Elena tell you that you were supposed because the video conference yes. the video conference that we had that ended, okay? 
This mm -hmm. is a new link. So mm -hmm. in order to get to this, ah, to this okay. section, you have to follow a link that she sent you. She told me that she had sent you the link before, right? Yes, yes, he, uh, she sent the message, but I I access uh, to this link, and uh, the the announcement said that you are in another meeting. I don't know. I don't know why. And how how uh -huh. did you get to this meeting? How did you get to this meeting? With with the other link that you sent. That I sent in the yes. group. Mm -hmm. Okay, so probably she sent the wrong link. Yes, I think so. Okay. Oh, sorry, coach. Um, teacher, I have a, a, a some words that I need the meaning. Okay, very um, good. Let's check. Uh, it's uh, the first is held. 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 Okay, so I'm gonna uh -huh. share. Held. I'm gonna share the screen with you. Okay. And like this, held. Okay. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay, let me see. Held. Okay, like this. Mm. Held. Yes, this one. Okay, yes. so this is the past tense of hold. You know what is the meaning of hold? Hold. 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 Colgar. Sostener, 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 okay. Sostener. So held okay. is the past tense of hold. Okay. Okay, very good. What and, else? Um, another one is outreach, outreach. Outreach. Outreach, uh-huh, outreach, okay. yes. Outreach. Yes, right yes. Outreach. Mm -hmm. Okay, do you know what is to reach? Reach is buscar. Alcanzar. Alcanzar. Ah, okay. And outreach es alcanzar más allá. Ah, okay. Outreach. Okay. And another one is fees with double E. Ajá, uh -huh. I know. You're talking about fees. Uh -huh. Okay. Now, okay, for example, eh, when you when you uh, go to a lawyer, Mm -hmm. Okay, and he is going to uh, charge you for whatever you're going to do. So that is a fee, un cargo. Ah, okay. cargo. For okay. example, in the credit card or in a, or in a, if you pay late in the credit card, there are extra fees or late. Okay. Fees. Okay. So that okay. means paying late. Okay. Okay. Paying late. And I I had a problem with the complex adverbs. I it it was difficult for me. <laughs> complex adverbs or complex subjects? I think that complex adverbs. Adverbs. Or you're talking or, about reducing adverbs. Yes, reducing adverbs. Yes, this adverb. Okay, Omar, Osman, are you there, Osman? And Eugenia? Yes. Okay. Yes, so I am, I am here. here. Okay, stay there. Stay there. Okay. So no problem, teacher. Okay. You so call they, me they, for a meeting? Yeah, is Eugenia, you are not scheduled, but you may stay. Okay, no problem. Okay. okay. <laughs> but you may stay. So uh, when we okay, uh, we have a sentence, okay? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. So I I was working late, okay? Mm -hmm. And I didn't mm -hmm. come. Okay. So I'm going to say mm -hmm. I was working late. Comma, so I didn't I didn't Home. So in this case, this is the uh, dependent clause, and this is the mm -hmm. So mm -hmm. in the dependent clause, we can we can omit. Okay, I can I can omit these two: the subject and the auxiliary verb. 
So ah, okay. I can say working late. Mm -hmm. Working late. I so I didn't come. And remember. Oh, okay. Okay, mm -hmm. and remember, okay, so you that happens when the ver the subject is the same in both clauses. Remember? Ah, okay. This, mm -hmm. That has to that, uh -huh. okay. you can do that when the verb is the same in both clauses. So you can omit the okay. subject and you can omit the helping verb or auxiliary verb. Okay, and only use mm, okay. working late, so I didn't. I come. didn't come. Okay. Okay, teacher, the the adverb in this case is late. Yeah, no, the, the whole adverb? is a clause. It's an adverb clause. Ah, okay. All this is the oh, adverb okay. clause. All this is the adverb clause. Okay. Okay. All this. I was working late. All that is the adverb. Okay. Clause. So what you reduce mm -hmm. is the clause, not the adverb, the clause. Okay. Okay? Okay, the now, clouds time are... has gone okay. out, okay? No. So I'm going to stay yeah, with us. Yeah, it's, it's enough. Thank you. Okay. Thank you. Very Bye. good, Alicia. Very good. Good night. Thank you so okay. much. Okay, very good. Now, Osman, what are your questions, Osman? You may, uh-huh. What are your questions, Osman? Uh, I have a lot of a lot of questions, but I I don't have many many times. But but the first is I, I don't I don't have, I don't have make very clear the use uh, transition transitions word. Transition words, okay. A transition. Yes, I, I don't. I don't. <laughs> okay, tell me, tell me. transition word is an expression is an expression that you use to unite, to join, to link two ideas, two sentences, or two paragraphs. That is a transition okay. word, okay? But, expression. but there is an um, um, order? Uh, no, not necessarily, okay? Now, the only thing is that transition words have Different, different meanings. For example, there are transition words of addition. So that means that you say one sentence and you want to add more information, okay, to what you already said. So that transition word is called transition of addition because you add, you provide more information about the first link, okay? Okay. Additional information. Now, there are transition words of cause and effect. For example, when you use because, when you use therefore, because those linking words, you see, they link one idea with another idea, but the purpose of linking is not additional information, is cause and effect. Is that clear? Yes. For example, we have others that they link with condition. For example, you say, eh, she will come tomorrow if she take the correct uh, bus. Okay? So you see, okay. if is joining both sentences okay. or both ideas. Okay. But the purpose of that connection is condition, right? Okay. Expresses a condition. So that is the meaning of a transition word, okay? And like I said, there are many, there are many. Let me show you real quick here, okay? Let me show you. Okay. So uh, there is no specific order to use this word, no. right? No, the only thing, the only okay. thing is that they must join. They must join two, two sentences, two ideas, or two paragraphs. Okay, that is okay. the purpose. I, I can use, uh, for, 
for example, we can use uh, the first uh, in addition, uh, and then I, I can yeah. use furthermore, and uh -huh, then moreover. Yes, but the example of those is to express more information, additional information. For example, here, okay. you see, here they have, okay, all these are transition words, but these are transition words of contrast. On the contrary, however, nevertheless. So those are transition words, but they show, they unite two ideas, they link two ideas, but with the meaning of contrast. Here, addition, okay? So, uh, uh, furthermore, in addition, also, as well as, because the purpose of these words are to add more information. Here, I have transition words of time, after, afterward, before, because they join two sentences, but they express what happens before, what happens after. Is that clear? Or what happens okay. at the same time, simultaneously? Are we clear? Okay. Now, yes. here we have transition words that the relation with the two sentences of the joining of the sentence is the space, concession, similarity, emphasis, details. So for different types of uh, joins, we use different transition words depending on the meaning of joining those two sentences. Okay. Okay. Teacher. Yeah. Yes. Thanks. Okay. Thanks, very teacher. good. Thank you so much. Thank you so much, teacher. Okay. Very good. Thanks no problem. For your time. Okay. Very good. Okay. Hey, and hey. I hope to see you tomorrow. Okay. I hope that. Okay. Very I good. I hope that too. Okay. Tonight. Excellent. Excellent. Okay, now I'm going to help Eugenia, okay? Hello, teacher. Hello, Eugenia. How are you? Fine. Okay, Fine. now how can I help you, Eugenia? Um, I got a lot of doubt in the using of the... Um, the last, the last uh, class uh, of transitions. Aha. Uh -huh. And what was the specifically? What I, did you? I, uh -huh. I've been thinking in that just. I mean, I mean, I'm going to find the workbook. Uh -huh. The workbook. Just hold. Um, just. Um, I think it's a page 20. Uh, I got a problem to open the, the book. Sorry. Okay, I go ahead. Take your time it. because I guess okay. you're going to be the last one. So we can take our time. Okay. Okay. No problem. Go ahead. Take the Amor, me puedes pasar el cargador, porfa. El cargador del, de la compu, porfa. Sí. El cargador y la extensión, por favor. Es para ti, mamá. Gracias, mamá. Eh, el mundo! No tengo ocho. Es de... de um, I got an idea about the transitions and, and the use of furthermore, moreover, and besides in addition. Uh -huh. um, for, because we did, when we, when we, do the exercise of page 22, I got an, um, 
an idea about this use, but when I got conf conf confused, how do you say? Confused. Confused. Oh, okay. Uh -huh. uh, is in in the use of the. Um, okay, so the adverbs. I have, I have the page. In the page fifteen. Fifty. Yeah, in the page fifty of the. In the use of 22. the adverb clauses. Ah, adverb clauses. Yeah. Page 15. Yeah, page 15, 15. Okay, very good, page 15. So, now remember, here is that we have two, two clauses, okay? I'm gonna share my screen with you. Okay. Okay, okay so here we have two clauses. Okay, so here we have two clauses. Now you yeah. have to recognize, for example, here, after we conduct a SWOT analysis, we will know whether to go on or stop with this project. So this is a dependent clause and because it has this adverb, is an adverb clause. And this is a, an independent clause. What is the difference between a dependent and an independent clause? If I only say this clause, you understand. But if I only say after we conduct a swell analysis, you say Wait, this sentence idea. is not complete, right? It okay. doesn't give yeah. you a complete idea. Are we clear? Yeah, I'm clear. Okay, so this is dependent and this is independent. So this is the adverb clause. It says that in order that we can reduce the adverb clause, the subject on this clause has to be the same subject as this clause. Okay. So yeah. in this case, it's the same subject, so we can reduce it. It also says that we are going to eliminate the subject, and we are going to add ing. So yeah. after conducting a SWOT analysis, we will know whether to go on or stop with this project. Yeah. Okay? Yeah. Now, it says right here, exactly what I have said, eliminate the subject in the advert clause. So we eliminated the subject, we, yeah. right? If the clause has a form of the verb be eliminated, so we don't have a verb be. But if the clause has any other verb different from be, add ing. So In you conduct, see, yeah. conduct, we add ing. Yeah. Okay? Now, let's see this other example. Before we make a decision, okay, and we still we need. need to go over the opportunities. So you see, it's the same subject. Yeah. So I can make the reduction. So before we eliminate the subject, make and make, I'm going mm -hmm. to add ing. So yeah. before making a decision, we still, still need to go over the opportunities. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay. Now, take I a look at 3A. I, I got more clear this task. Um, always I got confusion when in the use of the when subject, the we, and we have to change that. Um, uh -huh. Now, look at 3A. Yeah. Before the new product, what is the subject? The new product. The new product. Uh -huh. So before the new product project gets a green light, so look at the subject here, we. Are, do we have the same subject? No. Uh -huh. So we cannot make the reduction because it's not the same subject. So that is what you have to look for, that the subject of both clauses is the same. Then I can make the reduction. Otherwise, I won't be able to make the reduction if the subjects are not the same. So you can yeah. see right here, right? The subjects in the adverb clause and in the independent clause are different. So the so reduction should not be yeah. done. It's not possible. Is that clear? Yeah, it's clear. Do you have any more questions? No, no, just that, that 
that issue I have. Okay, so go ahead and practice with these sentences, with these uh, sentences and see if we can make the reduction. Okay. Yeah. We are going to do number one together after the product. So the subject is the, the product. product, the product de development team. After the product development team, that is the subject. Yeah. Okay, Finish and what is here? It is essential it is. to discuss ideas. There are no so, uh -huh. so the subjects are not it the same. Not. Right? And we can make a reduction. Uh, we cannot make a, a reduction. Now, yeah. look at this, number two. Before the manager, okay, in here, he had presented, so is the same subject? Yes, yeah. the manager and he is the same subject. The same. So here we can say before listing, the witnesses, okay. Uh -huh, the witnesses of the company, company on the slide, the slide yeah. comma, and the rest is the same. Yeah. Okay. Andrew Kittes messaging while he was in a video conference about the prototype for the new product. Andrew keep so, the test messaging. Uh -huh, so here we have Andrew, he. Andrew Kitt. Is he, right? And here yeah. we have the other clause and he. It's he. So it's the same subject. Yeah. So we're gonna say while while texting while texting messaging uh -huh, comma was was in a video in a video conference about the prototype. Exactly. Many very good. Yes, I ruled it out after they failed the product. Many promising products. Products idea is this the uh -huh. subject? Exactly. Many promising product ideas. Product ideas. Uh -huh. And look at the others and the other one right here. They. They. So they refers to many products. Product, promising product promising ideas. Yes. Uh huh. So it's the same, correct? Yeah. yeah now this cool. is the advert clause because uh, here uh, we have right. after. So many products, product, promising product ideas are ruled out, failing after failing to uh, produce positive results in the SWOT analysis. Why? Okay. Because the Dependent clause or the other clause is not at the beginning, it's at the end. The is that clear? Yeah. Okay. The business of a company can be transformed into opportunities after a careful contingency plan to alleviate them in the sign it. Is the witnesses of a company the weaknesses uh, of a company can be transformed yeah. uh -huh, into opportunities after yeah. a careful okay. contingency. Is this subject the same as this subject? No, no, no it's right? Same. So we can make the we cannot make the advert reduction. Advert reduction. And before you present a new idea to the manager, you need to present, here is the same, you and you. Exactly, so before? Presenting. Exactly, a new idea. New idea to the manager. Uh-huh. You need to present a detailed list. Of costs and benefits. Yeah. Okay, very good, excellent. An applause. <laughs> An applause. <laughs> Thanks, teacher. I, I think I, I can manage this if I can keep practicing. Okay, very good. So go ahead and practice. Do them again. Okay, write okay. them. Okay, I'm going to leave you because I have rough. Yeah, waiting. okay. Thanks okay. for your time, teacher. Okay, no, you, you're welcome all the time, okay? Have a wonderful night and rest. Thanks. Okay? Very Thanks. good. Bye.
Yeah. Okay, Raf. What about you, Raf? Hello, Raf. Hello, teacher. Yes. How are you today, Raf? Pretty good. How are you? I am fine. Thanks for asking. How can I help you today? You know, teacher, I was uh, uh, asking me the same thing. Ah, the, about the reduction. The Eugenia. Uh -huh. The reduction. The reduction. Okay, so let's check the reduction. That give me a... a okay. Yes. Okay, so let's talk about the reductions then. Okay. Yes. Um, I don't know. I really don't. It's, it's my first time that I, that I hear about ah. the reduction. In my reduction. first time. I, I... Okay. Is, is the same thing as, for example, when you have... Uh, when you have, in your case, sometimes a, in your case, you uh, you know some things in Spanish, but you don't know why, right? And you hear, what is that? Mm -hmm. And they tell you, ah, that is this, correct? Yes. Are you listening to me? I am listening. I am okay. listening. So that that is what is a a reduction, okay? Because yeah. because there are some a uh, because there is a is a grammar is a grammar a rule. Okay, it's a grammar rule. Okay. So, let's check it out then, okay? All right, all right. Okay, wait, wait, I have a call. Hello, hola. Okay. <laughs> y no ha entrado. Y aquí estoy. Vaya, pero... Eh, vaya, ok. Ok, so... Yes. Ok. Eh, so, an adverb... An adverb... Uh, 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 Eh, lo que creo, Madeline, es eh, que está en el... Porque los demás han podido entrar. Hola, hola. Sí, yo sé. Yo, este... Va, lo que vamos a hacer es que en la próxima reunión, el próximo miércoles, la voy a incluir. Le voy a decir a Elena. Oye, y yo le voy a mandar personalmente el enlace. Ok. Porque ahorita, porque ahorita ya no puedo hacer nada, ¿ok? ¿De acuerdo? Vaya, está bien, no hay problema. Y yo la programo para el próximo miércoles, ¿de acuerdo? Ok, you're welcome. You too, have a good night. Okay, so uh, let's take a look at the book. Uh, okay, just give me a minute. Just give me a minute. Okay, no problem, teacher.
Okay. So le, let me share let me share the book with you. Okay? Okay, thank you. That okay. is on page uh, 15, I think. Okay. So the adverb, okay, they call it an adverb clause. Okay, we have two clauses, dependent clauses and independent clauses. So in this case, the dependent clause is an adverb clause and the independent clause is a sentence. What is the difference? The difference is the, ind the independent clause can be explained by itself, okay? The dependent okay. clause needs another sentence to make sense the meaning of that group of words. So when I say after okay. we conduct a SWOT analysis, so what, what happened? So we need the rest. So the whole sentence has a complete idea. Is that clear? Yes. Okay, now. Yes. The adverb clause can be identified by by these uh, adverbs after, before, while. Okay. So yes. Now we need to clarify something. Okay, this is an adverb clause, but we can reduce it. What do we need to do to reduce it? Number one is that the ver the subject has to be the same in both clauses. Can you see? Oh, yes. In both clauses, yes. the we subject is the same. If that happens, I can make the reduction. How I okay. make the reduction? I eliminate the first subject. So I eliminate this. So I say after, and then the verb is going to be added ing. So you see, after conducting a SWOT analysis, and you see oh. that clause is reduced. Here it says, eliminate the subject in the other clause. If the clause has a form of the verb be or a helping, or a helping verb, eliminate the helping verb. In this case, we don't have a helping verb, okay? And if the clause right. has any other verb different from be, add ing. So, the verb is conduct, so we add ing. So we say, after, eliminate the subject, conducting, and to the verb, we add ing. So after conducting a SWOT analysis, we will know whether to go on or to stop with this project. Is that clear? Okay, yeah. Okay, now, the reduction is only possible when the subjects of the adverb clause and the independent clause are the same. same. So before we make, and here the subject is we, so yes, it's the same. So I can make the reduction before, and now the verb with ing. Before making a decision, we still the need decision. to go over the opportunities and threats that could affect the company, okay? Right. Now, look yep. at this example. Before the new product, this is the subject. Before the new product project. And look at this subject, we. Is the, are the mm -hmm. subjects the same? No. No, so the, re, the, re, the reduction is not possible. The subjects in the That's other true. clause and in the independent clause are different. So the reduction should yes. not be done. Is that clear? Yeah, yes. Yes, okay, so here yes. we have one. After the product development team, okay, finish. finish brainstorming, it is essential to discard ideas that are not feasible. Okay, are we talking about the same subject? The product development team? Yeah, the product development team is essential to this car idea. So it's the same subject. Exact. Okay, so right. I yes. Say, after yes. I eliminate the subject, after finishing, can you see? After finishing brainstorming, it is essential yes. to discard ideas that are not feasible. 
Yes, yes, yes. Okay. Now, number yes. two. Okay. Before the manager, before the manager, before the manager, that is the subject. Yes. Listed the weaknesses of the company on the slide. He, he had the same, right? The same subject. Yes. Yes. So he can make the reduction. So that will be right. before. This is the verb. Listen, listening. No, listing. Because listing. Because in the past. So before listing. Listing. Okay? Listing. You take that out. You take that ED out and add ING. ING. Uh huh. Because that is says right here. If the verb is and also be, add ING. Okay. okay. And also, and also, you take the manager out. Yeah, the subject. You remember? The subject. Yes. yes. Here yes. it says eliminate the subject in the advert cloud. That is correct. Okay. Right? Okay. Okay. Now. Yes. The, the next one, Andrew. Kept texting messaging, kept text, text messaging. Now, this is the advert clause. While he was in a video conference. So you see, it's the same subject. Yes. He? Yes, it's Andrew. Andrew. So you're going to say, Andrew kept text messaging while. And you see, he? this is the verb to be. So it's be, being, while being in a video conference so here be. because the verb is be in the past but the base form is be so to the verb right. form you are going to add ing so while being be plus ing because what is this verb the verb to be to be right right yes. okay and the yes. rest yes, is teacher. the same is the same. Many, uh -huh, many product, promising product ideas. Many promi product, many promising product ideas. They failed to produce. So it's the same subject. Can you see? Now the other clause is right here. So you're gonna say many pro promising product ideas are ruled out after. So you eliminate the they. subject and add ing after. Failing to produce positive. Failing. Uh -huh, after failing. Are we clear? Okay. Yeah. You, yes, teacher. Okay. So, very good. thank you. Uh, this, I I was confused because, confused because I, I, I don't remember ever seeing this. No right problem. Same. That's why we have these Sentence. personal interviews. So if you have something that is not quite clear, here we can clear them out, okay? Okay, very nice. Okay, very good. So I'll see you tomorrow then, okay? <laughs> Thank you, good night. Okay, have a good night. And Thank I you. hope you rest a lot, okay? Good. I'll, I'll do it. Thank you. Thank yeah, you. Yeah, me good too. Night. I will do it, okay? Have a wonderful okay. night, Rafael. Good night, teacher. Okay, very good. Thank you. You too. Okay, thank you.